Good evening, welcome to another edition of Plastic Models by a Regular Dude. Um, as you can see here, I've got the Monogram Amphibious Weasel out. I'm waiting for a uh, paint shipment so I can work on my other project. So in the meantime, so I can at least be doing something, I figured I'd give, um, start doing some preliminary stuff on this kit. I um, already went over it in a review already. I'll put a link below if you haven't seen it, but uh, very old kit. And as you can see, nicely packed. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start pulling the parts out and uh, start cleaning them up and get ready to start doing a little bit of assembly. All right, considering this is such an old kit and there are not very many parts, I figured what I'd start with is um, I'm just gonna cut all the parts off uh, since the parts count is really low and there's nothing too crazy going on and start cleaning up all the parts, trimming off flash, um, taking care of ejector pin marks, uh, test fitting, and then that way I can just start uh, figuring out how I'm going to assemble this because I am going to be doing some modifying. For example, uh, this back deck right here, um, I may cut these tools off and replace them with uh, um, you know, separate tools so you know just to make it look a little bit nicer so it's not just this molded on junk and then uh, these control lines here I'll probably cut those off and uh, redo those with some uh, stretch sprue or wire so that's what I've got going on so I'm going to start cleaning some of this stuff up and then we'll take a look and see what we got going so far okay so all the parts have been cleaned up flash removed ejector pin marks sanded down and uh, ready to start modifying some of these parts um, I built the main deck which basically consists of um, like a, some control like gear shift lever and then uh, the steering levers the steering levers the part was just gone I don't know if I lost it or if I left it on a sprue before I tossed it in the trash, but I had to scratch build some from some uh, plastic strip, glue the seats in. So that's pretty much ready to go. There's not a whole lot on the deck uh, to be done. Um, the parts I'm going to have to modify a bit that I wanted to improve the detail on. Um, first, we have the front deck portion. The only thing I'm really going to do here is cut this fire extinguisher off and I, I don't have one in my spares box so I'm going to have to scratch build one which this shouldn't be too hard. I'll just use a piece of sprue approximately the size I need. I'll sand it smooth and then round the end make like a handle control type valve on top and a couple of straps um, to strap it to the deck. But that's really all I'm going to do on that part. And then on the back deck, the parts I'm going to be modifying on this is I'm going to cut these tools off and replace them with uh, some better detailed and more scale sized tools. For example, here's a shovel I had in my spares box. And as you can see, it's a little bit shorter and the head's a little bit smaller. It's more to scale size for 135th. That's for, that'd be a huge shovel. I mean, that shovel's almost, you know, would be a scale four feet long, I think. So anyway, I'm going to cut those off, replace it with uh, spares. And then in cutting that off, I'm going to lose the detail of this hatch right here. So I'm going to, uh, with some plastic. Um, I'll just scratch build a new one and apply that. And then these two control rods here for the rudders, this con the control arms and then or rods and then this uh, linkage right here. I'm just going to shave that all the way off and replace it. I'll probably replace these big things um, with something a little more to scale, not quite so thick. So basically this is going to be completely shaved off and clean and I'll redo it. 
using stuff like that. So that's it for this update on the weasel and uh, stay tuned for more updates as they come. Uh, they may not come you know with a lot of regularity because I have another project I'm working on and this is just kind of filler in between kind of an exercise in scratch building and uh, detailing and seeing what I can do with an older kit to make it look a little better. So anyway, thanks for watch, watching Plastic Models by a Regular Dude. Keep an eye out for updates, questions, comments below, and I'll see you all later.